The Northeast faces a rare tropical storm threat this morning. Tropical storm Faye is expected to make landfall in New York or New Jersey later today. CBS News meteorologist and climate specialist Jeff Bardelli is along the Hudson River in Manhattan. So, Jeff, what's going on with this storm? Good morning, Vlad, and good morning, everybody. So what is going on with this storm is it's located that away. We are looking south along the Hudson River towards lower Manhattan. The clouds are thickening up. They are getting darker. There is a wall of rain about 70 miles south of here, and boy, is it raining heavy along the Jersey Shore. Now, this has already made history, this storm. is the first F storm, the earliest F storm that we have seen. It's two uh, weeks earlier than the last earliest F storm. This storm is going to be making its way up the eastern seaboard, producing three to five inches of rain today and tonight in places like Philly and New York City. Flash flooding is likely tropical storm warnings are out for that area. So watch out. It's going to be a rough and tumble day and night. But the bigger story is a huge heat dome that has built across the southwest and the lower plain states. And we are going to see incredibly high temperatures up to about 120 degrees in parts of the deep southwest this weekend. Some places even higher than that. And in the Plain States, as we head into Sunday and beyond into early next week, some spots approaching 110 degrees. This is going to be a relentless and historic heat wave because it's going to last very, very long. And we should get used to this as we continue to warm the climate. We're going to see more and more of these heat waves. That's something we want to get used to. Jeff, thank you very much.